perfect? Okay, so we had a call to action in the last video for people to drop name ideas for this van. We went through them, there were so many good ones. <laughs> That's it's hilarious. It's uh, hilarious. The two that come to mind right off the bat, in fact, hold on, let me, let me look this up. Okay, the names that you guys drop are too numerous to remember. So I loaded up YouTube, I actually have Wi-Fi here in the van. This is really weird, by the way. It's a weird feeling. It's a weird feeling. <laughs> I'm in a van with Wi-Fi and I'm gonna also sleep in this van. Anyway, the first one that got the most upvotes was from our friend Morgan, who's been watching our videos basically since the beginning. An adventurer himself. It, yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, Eight upvotes, including our own, for Vanny McVan face. <laughs> That's a good one. We have Bine with Vanessa, which is good. I like it. I, I like it. it. Steve. We've gotten a couple of people saying that this van's name reminds them of Eric Estrada from Chips. Because it's a Lustrada. It's a Lustrada. So here we have uh, Eric Lustrada, aka Chips. We actually had a couple people mention that. That's a good one. That's very good. Vanny Annie Nanny, shortened to Van. Oh, that's a good acronym, one. I guess. Is that, is that an acronym? I don't know. Tacoma Warrior Van. Stella. Uh, Chakra? Whoa, okay. Fe Frederico Van Gogh. What do we got? What do Where's we got? Where's Poop Machine 5000? Yeah, exactly. I love that one. That was Lynn's favorite, yeah, I think. Yeah, I think Poop Machine 5000. Poop Machine 5000. Caesar. Very appropriate. We're here in Rome. Fantastic. Sophia. After so Sophia Loren. Sophia sorry. Loren. Yeah, sorry, sorry. Hasta La Strada, baby. That's not so much a name, but just a cool saying. The Campster Van. Vampy Vampster. Those are three ideas and I like all of them. <laughs> Frankie. Okay, so those are all awesome. Thank you so much for commenting and leaving these suggestions, but we have a winner. It actually happens to be none other than Lynn's... My grandpa. grandpa. Today is his birthday and he suggested Van Gogh. Van Gogh. He's been loving me since 1982, so I've been loving him since then too. So in honor of my grandpa's birthday today, meet Van Gogh. Van Gogh, yay! And I think somebody actually did mention Van Gogh, so super uh, fitting name. This is this is our home for the next three weeks, uh, and I feel weird. So let's do a quick tour. Okay, this tour is going to be pretty short because this is a very small van. <laughs> this is the front seat, passenger seat, driver's seat. Wow! Ooh. And here's Lenny. Trying to organize. to organize our shit. Yeah, we don't have much, but speaking to other people who camp in vans, they're like, organization is key. So I'm trying to make sense of it in my head. So, yeah. yeah. So our laundry and other things. This is the table that doubles as our bed. Here's a view from the outside. And we have a bathroom. It's uh, incredibly tiny, as you can see but we have one. So if we have to get up in the middle of the night to go to the bathroom or pull off on the side of the road, at least we have somewhere to go and we can actually shower. This thing pulls out here and uh, yeah, that's that's it. That's how we would shower in this thing. Uh, can you get it back in? She said, okay. So that's the bathroom. We also have a sink and a stove. Also another cutting area and underneath, we have a fridge! We have a fridge With that things. keeps things actually really cold, almost too cold. Yeah. We had to turn it down. So I think that's about it. And then there's, of course, the exterior of the van. Mm -hmm. Here we're plugged in. The cord runs all the way to here. Anyway, that's pretty much it. Uh, all we have left to do tonight is to go shopping. And then to actually plan our route, so we're obviously heading north through Italy and we're gonna be going to Florence and then maybe Venice. Oh, Noah. Whoa. Holy smokes, look at all Look at them. that. It's like murmuration. Holy shit. Look. Yeah, and there's tons of them off in the distance over here too. There are probably like 100,000 plus birds above us right now. It's insane. Wow. Wow, this is cool. There's it's like they're literally making a complete circle around our camper van. Yeah, very interesting. And when they go overhead, you can hear drops of bird shit falling nearby you as if it were raining. Because yeah. actually it is raining. It's raining bird shit, but 
I'm fine. Yeah. It's worth it. If I get shat upon, here cool. we go. Here comes more. Here come. I can I can totally hear the bird poop. I'm gonna get shit on. Under normal circumstances, I wouldn't care so much about getting shit on by birds, but uh, laundry is now more tricky to do. So, see right there. Okay, I'm hiding from the bird poop. Uh, that's the end of the update. We're gonna keep these videos short while we're traveling in the van just because of Wi-Fi uh, capabilities and uploading long videos is gonna be a super challenge. But we are gonna keep you up to date. We have a lot of videos coming down the pipeline including some of the videos that we shot for Yellow Hostel in Rome. And those will be, again, shorter videos. Uh, so keep your eyes out for that and more van adventures and lots of other shit. Anyway, that's it, bye.